Splatterween is real, fellas. We won. We waited until the last possible day, Friday the 13th, and we are blessed. Bless the Splatfest coming Friday, October 27th at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time through Sunday, October 29th at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. The Splatfest asks which could be the best friend to have. But man, look at the artwork. Look at the new outfits. Where are the devil horns, though? Look at the plaza. Look at Shiver and then Fry and Kelly Marie and Big Man. Ooh, oh my God, Big Man, what did they do to you? Legit, I think I'm picking Team Ghost because of that silly outfit. I I think it swayed me. All of the teams are good. It's Zombie versus Skeleton versus Ghost. Zombie films and books are prime material. Imagine being able to befriend a zombie, a creature that's supposed to be so far gone, but no, we're going full Disney zombies out here. <laughs> Skeletons? Come on, Sans. Sans is here. Spooky, spooky, scary skeletons. But you know why I can't choose Team Skeleton? Inklings and Octolings don't have bones. Who knows, man? Maybe some Octoling sorcerer. Think of the Wizard versus Knight Splatfest from long ago. Is planning to revive a skeleton army right now from Shellendorf Institute and prove us all wrong. Watch out! <laughs> and ghosts? Come on, Casper. The friendly ghost, Scratch from Molly McGee. Uh, there's purple ink. Ghosts are just little guys. They don't have to be scary. They can have good souls, and I want to befriend one. Imagine having a ghost pal that could gallivant through a wall and check out something for you without you having to get up. Amazing. Let's look at this Splatfest from a theoretical Splatoon in-game lens. It would work there too. Your ghost pal checking behind the walls you can't look behind or flying up a ledge to make sure you don't get jumped by any opponents. Awesome. Epic. What Inkling or Octoling wouldn't want that kind of advantage? Admittedly, of the three in this scenario, the ghost is probably the only one that wouldn't be able to fight. But hey, that means you picked the support main to be your friend. And I've played um a little bit of Splattershot Jr. and NZAP in my time, so it's perfect for me. <laughs> and we got our second scare this morning too. Um, they're fixing Mahi Mahi Resort. I could cry. I'm sure I'll still be falling off the map plenty. That'll never change. But it looks like from the image provided, they'll be altering the spawn and the islands on the map. It could be a lot better depending on how they go about it. But you want to know how to guarantee a win for Team Ghost, right? Simple. We're in spooky season. It's time to get ready to jump scare your opponents like a ghost. Find them at the corners of the map. Jump down from above. Hold that special until the pivotal moment. You know, your jump scare zooka. <laughs> Splats are fast. If you don't give your foes time to react, you will be on top. Reach deep inside your mind and become the aggressor you have always wanted to be corny Halloween killer style and the results will slide your way before you know it. Now excuse me, but um, I have to go make a purchase. Bye. Oh yeah! <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no. Okay, so like they have a ton of skeleton stuff and you get to the ghost stuff and that's it. This, this, this is not great. <laughs> I guess I own this now. <laughs> what happened? Wow, they really tell you just, just don't, don't do anything with this. Do, do not, do not do anything with this shirt. <laughs> now, this is what we call content. <laughs> I can't, I can't, I can't take it seriously. I can't, I can't. I can't even zoom out far enough to get like the full, Kind the kind of sort of poncho interview. I'm I'm sorry to tell you this fear Halloween, but I, I think I'm giving this a, I think I'm giving this a t a two out of ten on the on the spooky scale right now. You know it could still change, but um. <laughs> Bye.